Berlin is my home. The Moabit district of Berlin was once a working class neighborhood. Danny Hawk opened Angor Wat here in 2006. Back then, it was Germany's first Cambodian restaurant. It's just a stone's throw from Bellevue Palace, the official residence of the German president. Danny Hawk gets many of his ingredients in Asian food stores or at the wholesaler. The more exotic ingredients can't be found in many grocery stores. I like coming here. It's near my restaurant, so it's a quick trip, and I can get everything I need in my kitchen. These lime leaves have an intense flavor. We use them for seasoning. I love them. <laughs> Danny Hock came to Germany in 1988, when he was just 19. In Cambodia, he grew up with foster parents and an uncle after losing his entire family to the brutal Khmer Rouge regime. He still has contact with his foster father and others back home. Three years ago, Danny and some friends paid a visit to the place in Cambodia where, as a nine-year-old boy, he had buried his own mother. The mayor of the local community also helped him find his mother's grave. And Danny held a Buddhist ceremony in her memory. Although he still feels a strong tie to Cambodia, today Danny calls Berlin home. When I think of home, I remember my parents in Cambodia, when I was little. I miss it a lot. I also miss the food my mother used to cook for me. I wasn't allowed to help, just watch. I remember the food and the scents. Those familiar scents always remind me of home. Amok tray is a traditional Cambodian dish. Amok comes in many different versions. It can be made with fish, usually monkfish, pangasius, or sea bass, or with chicken or tofu. Cambodian food is flavorful, but not as spicy hot as many other Southeast Asian cuisines. is a Cambodian term for cooking curry in banana leaves. Tray means with fish. Steaming helps the dish develop its flavors. Amok tray is served in a bowl on a bed of banana leaves and rice. In Cambodia, we use different vegetables. One is similar to spinach, for example, but not the kind that we know here in Germany. People here don't like it much. That's why we also use other ingredients, like pineapple, bell peppers and mushrooms. But the basic flavor of our amok is the same as you'd get in Cambodia. In Cambodia, shared meals are an important part of the culture. It's a tradition that Danny Hawk wants to pass on. He sees his role not just as chef, but as host too. It's cozy here and I like that. The place just has a very nice feel to it. The waiters are very friendly and happy to recommend nice dishes. It's very homey here. Whenever I long for our food back home, I come here and speak Cambodian with the owner and listen to my music playing in the background. 
then I feel like I'm back home. They've adapted some of the dishes to European tastes, but it's always delicious. You can eat a lot without getting fat, too. <laughs> the Cambodian community in Berlin is still fairly small, but many come here to Angkor Wat to enjoy the familiar foods and flavors. Thank you.